Hello, it's me, Brandon Burns, aka Ratty Ruffman from YouTube, and uh, I'm going to be doing another DVD review. This movie, uh, it is a sequel, but it's not really supposed to be a sequel or a prequel. It's an equal. Yes, it's a shock treatment. This is, you know, I guess you can say the sequel to the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Directed by Jim Sharman. Uh, you know, a screen, screenplay by Richard O'Brien and Jim Sharman, uh, the creators of the Rocky Horror Picture Show. In this movie, uh, everybody's in the... It's like a TV studio world in the, in the town of Denton. And uh, Brad and Janet, played by different actors. In the original movie, they were played by uh, Barry Bostrick and Susan Sarandon. In this movie, they're played by... Uh, Cliff D. Young and Jessica Harper, yeah. So basically, their marriage is on the rocks, and they go to this um, TV studio in some kind of TV studio. It's doctor doctor's office. I can't remember the whole plot. Uh, it's kind of it's hard to explain this movie, but uh, it's a musical just like in Rocky Horror. They sing. They have some cool songs in it too. And this, uh, yeah, Brad. Uh, Majors, hold on, was, I meant to say Brad, uh, the character of Brad, his brother, I think it's his evil twin brother, I can't remember, but I know it's his brother, trying to get Janice to like him or whatever, trying to win Janice's heart, he's played by, uh, Barry Humphreys, hope I got his that name right, Barry Humphreys. But yeah, that's basically it's a musical movie. They're trying to get uh, Janet to leave Brad or marry his twin brother, be some kind of dictator of Denton in the TV studio. I can't remember. It's hard to explain. You just gotta watch this movie. But if you're fans of the Rocky Horror Picture Show, you might enjoy this uh, sequel. It's got cute, cool music in it too. Like you need a bit of ooh shock treatment. Look out, Mr. Nuckyman, Mr. Now. Now. You know, I also have some cool mu music like bitching in the kitchen and crying in the bedroom all night and just a little bit of snip, snip, snip. Little Black Dress, that's what that song's called. Snip, snip, snip. As what I heard about this movie, Richard O'Brien. They made changes a lot in his uh, script, and he disowned this film, but he did praise how good the soundtrack is. One of that on the internet movie database, whatever, but uh, I don't know if he still has a change of heart about this movie, but uh, I can see him, you know, not liking it in his own opinion. But it also co-stars, uh, you know, Richard O'Brien, who played Riff Raff, and Patricia Quinn, you know, who played Magenta in the Rocky Horror Picture Show as a... Uh, I forget the characters' names in the movie, forgive me, but I guarantee you the characters, Dr. Nurse, are still brother and sister, like in the Rocky Horror Picture Show, they played a brother and sister, and uh, Neil Campbell, who was hot in this movie, played the other uh, nurse, who she also played uh, Colum Columbo in the Rocky Horror Picture Show, Columbia, I forget her character's name sometimes. But yeah, check out Shock Treatment, it, it took me a while to find this movie, I found this at Dollar General... I, I guess 2014. It's been a little couple of years ago. But check it out if you do like the Rocky Horror Picture Show. This movie is not really uh, great as the Rocky Horror Picture Show. But it's a cool movie too. It is a it is a good movie. Shock treatment. You know, it's just... Basically that famous song that's in this movie. I already told you. Uh, you need a bit of shock. A little bit of shock treatment. What was the other league with it? What were the other lyrics to that song? I can't remember. Playing doctor and nurse, it can be good for your health. But if you open your eyes to the heart of science, or something like that. Yeah, that's what I'm going to say. Please check out Shock Treatment. Uh, um, there was some trivia in this movie. Hold on. I think it's, there's, there's a trivia booklet in this DVD. Let me see if I can get it out. Yeah, there it is. Shock treatment. The booklet. Oh boy. There's some trivia. Tim Curry was offered the role of Brad Majors 
and Farley Flavors. I think that was his brother's name. Uh, Brad Majors' brother. But declined because he didn't think his American accent would be convincing. And I remember there was also talks about trying to get Tim Curry to reprise his role as Dr. Frank Furter. It didn't happen. Cliff D. Young modeled his performance as Farley after Jack Nicholson. Yeah, I think Cliff D. Young played the brother and the twin brother. I can't remember. I'm not really good at remembering stuff. I think he played him and his brother. Who knows? But you gotta watch the movie for yourself. But Richard O'Brien and Patricia Quinn portrayal in in it's sister is they play the siblings in both the Rocky Horror Picture Show as Riff Raff and Magenta and Shock Treatment as Cosmo and Nation McKinley. Yeah, that was their character's name. So they both play siblings and siblings in both movies. Barry Bostwick was unable to reprise his role as Brad Majors due to other filming commitments. And they tried to get Barry Bostwick back here. I don't remember if they tried to bring, try to bring, brought back, I'm sorry, Susan Sarandon, but, you know, it is what it is, you know. Okay, although several cast members from the Rocky Horror Picture Show appear in Shock Treatment, only one, Jeremy Newsom, returns as the same character, Ralph Hapshat. Yeah, you know, Ralph Hapshat, that small groom in the first Rocky Horror, he's only out there that reprises his character role. I mean, reprises his role, you know. Uh, Shock Treatment's original working title was The Brad and Janet Show. Founder and longtime president of the Rocky Horror Picture Show fan club Sal Pyra, Pira, I'm sorry, I can't pronounce the names right sometimes, has a camo role in Shock Treatment. He can be seen talking on the telephone during the opening sequence. The idea of having Shock Treatment sitting inside a TV studio instead of. Hold on. Sorry. Various various locations in and around the fictional town of Denton was inspired out of necess- necessarily the film's production budget was several several I'm s- I was trying to say the film production budget was severely cut due to a Screen Actors Guild strike. Several of the costumes and props from Rocky Horror, the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Including Frank's throne, painted red, can be seen in shock treatment. That's some trivia for you. Yeah, I'm not going to read. I just wanted to read the trivia. And check out, this book looks cool too. Check out shock treatment and I'm about to end this video. Please subscribe to my channel. You don't have to like me. You don't have to respect me. Please just subscribe to my channel. I need more subscribers. Anyway, that's it. I'm out. Check out shock treatment and the Rocky Horror Picture Show.